I grew up in Mexico. I grew up in Tijuana, Mexico, and I um, I like to infuse those flavors that I grew up with. So today we're making a really simple but really delicious chicken rubbed in chipotle. Do you guys mm, want to help me sounds out? Sounds great. Absolutely. You, you say yeah. spices are good for people. Spices are good for people. Chiles actually rev up your metabolism, right. which are conducive to weight loss, and it's also considered an aphrodisiac in Mexico. Hello. So hello. Hello. Only in Mexico? Wait a minute. <laughs> no, in the worldwide. Worldwide. <laughs> <laughs> Works in the Palisades. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> <laughs> Jalapenos. Well, the chicken does sound, it sounds delicious. Where do, where do we start? Okay, so you're going to be on chicken, is that correct? I got gloves, so okay. I'm ready to do whatever you okay, want me to yeah. do. We've got raw chicken. You want to pop that chicken in there? I want to absolutely you can just do, do a couple. You don't have to do the whole thing. So two in here. Yes, please. You tell me when I screw up and I'll right stop. In there. Just like that. A sprinkle of chopped fresh oregano. A little <laughs> bit of chipotle powder that you can find at any supermarket across the country. Because I am mm. going to eat this afterwards. Chopped fresh garlic. Ooh, can you nice. smell that? That Doesn't smells delicious. Smell wonderful. Yeah, you know what? Garlic, I'm a huge fan. Throw the whole thing in there. You can't have enough garlic. Garlic. Can't have I enough garlic. Mean. A little bit of salt and pepper. A little salt and pepper. And then can lot. we ask the queen, la reina, if you can drizzle <laughs> a little bit of oil in there? Let me drizzle some <laughs> oil, tiny. man. You wanna drizzle some Look oil at all that chicken. salt that's you put good. on that that's chicken. That's good, that's good. You need a lot of salt, right? Yeah, but you know what? We're also seasoning the salad so you don't have to go crazy on the salt. Did you I'll, eat the oil? No. <laughs> did you just take a shot of that? <laughs> I did. <Yeah. laughs> okay, <laughs> now you massage the chicken. Give it a nice massage. Yes, rub that in. This is happening. rub. This is happening. We gotta make sure that's good. Uh, okay. But Marcella, what do yes. you do for people who can't handle so much heat in their food? What's well, a good uh, substitution? I always like to say, you know, do one jalapeno at a time. If you feel like you can't handle spicy food, taste it first. You don't have to follow the recipe. Do whatever you want to do. And then, if you want to go for chile that's not as spicy but more smoky, go for the dry chiles like guajillos or pasillas. Mm -hmm. So you don't have nice. to go for a full heat habanero or serrano every time. This, you're okay. doing really good. Are with you that. ready to cook? I mean, I'm, this is, I, I don't think it's ever looked better. <laughs> it looks beautiful. <laughs> Come on over here. And you're on the saute pan. I think you can take your gloves off. All right. And would you mind helping me with the salad? Sure. Okay, what you're kind on of the salad saute we making? Paper. I love all these ingredients so far. Okay, so we've got shredded Brussels sprouts. Mm -hmm. You're going to add those in there, please. And you can use tongs if you don't have gloves anymore. I nice high heat. Tongs. What could possibly go wrong? No, nothing. It'll be good. <laughs> so we've got Brussels sprouts, a little bit of kale, queso fresco. Queso fresco. Que I love that you speak Spanish. You've got a perfect I accent. I understand better than I speak. It but sounds I, really know. sexy. And, and then some <laughs> almonds right here. <laughs> I really love it. I'm just saying. A little bit of kale. How are you doing over there? You want the them chicken? both in there or you want just the one? I think you can just start with one so that you don't steam them because it's a small pan and I'm going to turn the heat up just for yeah. you. Yeah, you, do that. Like you that. turn yeah, the heat let's up. Let's turn the heat up right there. <laughs> queso, queso, Add queso. Add a little bit of cheese and then would you mind adding the dressing, la reina, por favor? Sure, what kind of dressing is this? Really simple dressing. Lemon juice, I a little it. bit of Dijon to kind of bind everything mm. together, olive oil because you need that oil, salt and pepper, shallots, and that's pretty much it. It smells really good. And this good. is good for you too. And whenever right, you're doing, you don't want to add the whole thing. You just want it to be nice and moist, but not completely drowning in the dressing. So is that about enough? I think that's good. And then we can Let's just fold it, it through. See. We might need to add just yeah, a little bit more. a little bit more. And I've got some quinoa in there that's gluten-free. It's got tons of protein. It's really good for you, but it's really delicious. I love quinoa. I don't know where it's been all my life, but <laughs> you know I... Whole Foods on but... San Vicente. <laughs> Right next to the nipple cream. Okay. Isn't that the one where that guy with the <laughs> neck tattoo? Yeah. <laughs> He's my this buddy. Looks good. So this is what it looks like. Thank you. You did a beautiful job with that chicken. I'm doing Thank really you well. Very much. That's what it looks like when you're done cooking it. So you I did a good job. I love the color. I love the color. The color means flavor for me. It nice and caramelized with that yes. chipotle on the beautiful. top. It just gives a great flavor to that salad. And you're getting that. After what are you? What are you doing? What's happening? I'm just smiling. You know what I mean? <laughs> Hanging out with you, cooking just chicken. Smile. Do you want to try smell it? That? It smells amazing. I'm going to eat this. It, that smells so good. Do you and there's your salad. You can. You, <laughs> it's your chicken. Here. It's my chicken. That is there your you chicken. Know. That's not done yet. No, no, you don't have to eat that one. Eat this one. Oh, this is it done. Yeah, this is it done. <laughs> oh, yeah. It all happened so fast. I didn't know what happened. And then I also brought some wow. coconut flam for you guys and I mean, an avocado, oh avocado dip with roasted this. cauliflower. Wow. Just a little bit of everything for you wow, guys to try out. I'm going to put a little bit of extra dressing there on it. There you go. That's how it works. I'm going to swing a little <laughs> bit of this around here and mix it up a little bit. I love the almonds on it because it's got a little extra crunch. Uh, texture it's there. important, that crunch. You always have you to have, have the crunch. You've got to have the crunch and the quinoa with the protein. This is so good for you. This is Russell a success. Sprouts, kale. Quinoa. Quinoa. Chipotles. Chipotle. Chicken almonds. Chicken almonds? Well, yo. Almonds. I that's, think that's delicious. <laughs> and most importantly, queso fresco. Exactly. So what kind of do I heard we had flan down here. Oh, come see the flan. Come see the flan. I love flan. How's that chicken coming? Coconut Going really flan. slow. <laughs> <laughs> we 
gonna we'll have to get your chicken game up, man. I, it's not hot enough. I preheated <laughs> it, but it's just, these induction burners, just, they don't need it. But you know what? We have the beauty That's for okay. you. That's okay. And we're gonna we're gonna have, have to let somebody taste this. Hey. <laughs> there you go.